returning shortly. Alright, I'm just getting into my home station and I thought I would uh, show you a little bit of some of the planning that goes on in going into low sec, which you should do if you're going to go into low sec at all. So you'll want to look up the station that you're going into and you can do that by if you click on the map and go to uh, what is it called? People and Places, little button up here. And then type in the, the low sec system. Right click on it and go show on map and it'll show it on the star map here. There it is, there's Aunt Sella. And if you go, this little window will, pop, will come up, world map, control panel, go to star map, stars, go down to statistics. Go down to statistics and you can get all kinds of nice little information here. So, ship destroyed in the last hour is useful. So, someone's ship got blown up. How about the last 24 hours? That's quite a few. Uh, there's also jumps in the last hour you can look at. You can look at pilots docked and active, too. Uh, pods, so that's certainly pirating activity if there's pods killed. And then average pilots in space last 30 minutes. About 11. Keep in mind that that's also including passerby. So if you're just going through the system and you get clocked in half an hour, then that'll show up. So it doesn't mean that there's 11 people there right now. It just means in the last half an hour, 11 people have been in and out. But it's certainly the one that says about docked. That can tell you there's two people sitting in the in the system. But they might be just watching the system. They might be AFK. That's not a big deal. The main indicators of uh, like a big warning sign to not venture in would be uh, pods destroyed in the last hour uh, mean that there might be a gate camp there or uh, ships destroyed in the last hour uh, and 24 hours you can get a, a sense of what's going on keeping in mind that I'm not going in with a freighter if I was then I probably wouldn't go in right now and usually when I did I actually would go in at strange periods of time like at not in the evening like right now. I would go in at uh, noon or I would go in at uh, one in the morning or something. So I wouldn't, it would be like a low uh, traffic uh, time. And just as an example, here's Rancer. This is a nasty one that connects, I think, Citad, uh, Forge and uh, Galente. Uh, What's it called? Uh, I'm not going to know now. I can't think of it now. Uh, Galente is main region and Forge uh, is racer. Uh, it's the one, it's the bottleneck. And people sit there and camp it all day and all night. There's gate campers. So, for example, ships during the last hour, there's two, but look at 24 hours. 65 and pods nothing in the last hour but 24 hours 62 pods so they're probably nailing shuttles and I have been nailed in raised Rancer before um, I'm not sure what I was in I don't know what I was flying but I got uh, blown up there uh, they just sit on the gate and they smart bomb and they blow up pretty much everything that comes through um, and if you and then if you, you, if you have a ship that can survive smart bombs, like a battleship or pretty much anything, a cruiser might even better survive the smart bombs. What will happen is they'll have people on the other side of the gate who will get you. Because as you're warping, as you're taking about 10, 15 seconds to warp out from appearing on the next system after you've jumped through the gate, uh, they'll grab you there too. So usually gate camps are on both sides. So they nail people trying to blitz through by smart bombing you because most people will warp a zero through those places. And if you don't, you're still dead. Uh, but if you do make it through the smart bombs and you appear on the other side, then they'll nail you when you're warping away. Unless you have a covert ops, then you can get through, but they'll still hit you with the bombs. They just won't be able to lock you. All right, so that's... I'll get out of that now, and I've just got into my, uh, it's called a Bustard, Tier 2 uh, Badger 2. It holds 30,000 um, M3s, which is pretty good. Um, the Iteron 5 holds a lot more, but Iteron 5s are weak, whereas this thing is a lot stronger. 
So it's pretty good. I used to put cans in it. Uh, it can hold even more, but I don't need to do that right now. So I'm going to take this down to uh, Otsella. And as soon as I get down there, then we will start hauling in the minerals so we can keep building the, uh, the rest of the components. So as soon as I get down there, I'll be, be back. Okay, we've made it down to uh, one jump out of low sec. So we're still in high sec, but we're one jump away from it. And that's one jump from the target system, which is Otsella. And I'm just going to dump my minerals into here and get into my covert ops. So this is the this is the ship here. It's called a crane. It is, um, I guess, it's also a Badger Mark II, but it's uh, one of the other. It's a uh, tier two, uh, but it's of another variant other than the big hauler. It's the it's this covert ops with a cloak. And it's got I've got a bunch of cans in here because I it the can holds more than its volume in the ship. It's a paradox of physics, uh, which is a good a good thing for me. So I'm just going to fill the cans. I guess I could do that from here. Uh, I'll just put the isogen. I usually kind of split it up a bit because if I got blown up, then I don't lose all the minerals of one kind. So I'll just do that. So, there we go. And then there's some I can put in here. There. Okay. And then we're going to go... Oh, um, I'm just going to check this system one more time in case something happened. So we'll just check... Uh, ships destroyed in last hour. One. I think it was one before, right? That doesn't matter. Pause. No, it's fine. How about uh, average system? Only two? Oh, it's empty then. Well, there's nobody there. How about docked? Uh, yeah, this one. Five docked? Okay, well... I don't know why... Well, I guess two people are active, but five are docked? I don't know. Okay, it looks okay. It looks quiet. And anyways, I'm in a covert op ship, so even if someone is on a gate and they're just warped off a bit, they're not going to be able to touch me coming in. The only thing that can stop the ship I'm using right now would be a gate camp, and that would have to be, there'd have to be like about five or six people sitting on a gate, and there isn't even that many people active, so that won't be a problem. All right, here, this is it. This is it. We're getting into it now. We're getting into some serious shit now could be some blowing up of uh, materials of my assets and this trusty cloak bill will save the day okay go in we'll check local to see who's in here when we get in there's a few people in here I don't see any corpses around the uh, the gate, which is a good sign. Just the gate guns. So let's warp, and then we're going to cloak. So as soon as you, you click to go to a station, it's going to pull you out of cloak, because in, no matter what ship you use, um, it'll cloak you when you enter a new system. Uh, but after that, you can then activate the cloak if you have one, and then your cloak, and you can cloak while you're warping. So pretty much impossible to catch you unless they're smart bombing the area and for that they need to gate camp and they don't have that so and we'll get to the station no one's at the station and we'll dock Docking permission requested. and Docking we'll do that one more time I hope Let's see who's even in this. Let's see who's sitting in There's three people sitting in here. Whoops. Okay, let's just drop this stuff in. And then I'll build a couple things while I'm sitting in here. So what was I trying to do before? Was it, uh... I think it was Siege. Where's Siege at here? I think I was trying to build 30 of these. Let me do that. It's done. 
Now what else do we need? I probably shouldn't even be doing this sitting in low sec. I probably should be trying to spend as little time as possible in here. Uh, why don't we combine... Because I was going to build a Thanatos too. So I need 10 shield for the revelation. How many uh, shields does the Thanatos need? It needs 6, so I'll build 16. 16 shield. I don't think I'll even have enough manufacturing slots to build all this stuff. Because I need a lot of stuff. And what else? Uh, tw uh, 10. Looks like I've got... I need 20, but I have 10. So I've got 10 sensor, and then how many here? Uh, 7. Okay. I think they lowered that. I think they lowered the material requirements for Thanatos, because that doesn't ring a bell as being 7. Okay, sensor. So 17 of these. Alright, well you get the idea. Um, so I'm going to go out and get the... So some people just left. I'm going to go out and get the other order. And then come back out. And finish up the... Uh, finish up building the components. And then I'll do a little couple minute recap of what I've done. And then I'll, wait, I'll have to wait a week until I get the rest of it done. So let's get out of here now. I can't cloak where I am right now because of the stations too close to me. But that doesn't matter. That's okay. All right. Okay, so I'll be right back. Okay, so I couldn't get them all done. As you can see, I filled up my manufacturing slots here. Some of them pending, which means that the slot had already something working on it, so it has to wait for that first thing to finish, and then my order will start. Um, and some of my minerals you see are drained here, uh, but 100, tr 100 mil trade gone just from those. So what I'll do is over the week or so, I'll keep putting in the new ones as they get built. And the next time I record, all the materials will be done. And then I will start the Thanatos and the Revelation. You'll see that. And then I'll record again when they're finished, and I'll fly them around a little bit. So I will... Uh, uh, see you back then. And I'm back, and all this stuff is done. The last two right here. I'll just deliver them right now. And this one. And so now we have all the stuff finished. All the components. And that's to make one revelation and one Thanatos. So we'll just do those right now. There, all the stuff is right there. It'll take 10 days. And the Thanatos. There it is. Another 10 days. Well, it's going to be the same time. Okay, I'll be back in 10 days.